What's up, everybody? It's the homie Truth Teller, the street reporter. And a lot of people been asking me about uh, Billionaire Black and Lil Reese. I guess they seen recently that, you know, they kind of had a dispute over the Internet. I guess Lil Reese said something about he don't know nothing about FBG. Only FBG he know is like future them. And I guess Billionaire Black took that disheartening. You know, he didn't really take that the right way. He kind of went to the Internet disrespectful. Talk about the time. He got beat up, kind of alleging that he used the bathroom on himself instead of just having like gravel and shit on him and stuff like that. To be honest with you, I don't think um, I don't think Billionaire Black really respected what Larry said. We know about their past issues and shit like that. That's why I was telling you guys, you know, that beef is still here. It's still brewing. It's just not amongst the big rappers. It's more like the communities and shit. You get caught in the wrong neighborhood, then. That shit's still going on. You just might not hear rappers rapping about it because a lot of them then lost their lives. To be honest with you, man, Lil Reese just got shot in the neck. Uh, all kind of things going on. King Von lost his life. Billionaire Black still mourning FBG Doug. I think those guys got bigger fish to fry instead of be beefing with each other on this internet. That shit kind of played out if you really think about it. We understand you guys don't like each other. You got a real beef going on. Plenty of lives lost between each other. Plenty of shootings. Plenty any of internet beefs. I don't think this should ever be reconciled if you ask me. I think future generations are going to inherit this beef, inherit this war. I just think it's a strong hate, a strong dislike for each other for some strange reason. These communities been beefing and shooting and killing each other for a long time. Um, Lil Reese kind of sparked it with that though. I guess a fan, uh, somebody kind of sparked him to say that and he said that and he don't realize how big he is. Everybody's watching. The fans are stay instigating shit so i guess they kind of pumped that up for billionaire black to respond uh this is the crazy part larissa has lived not in chicago now, i'm not saying you don't be out there every day but that dude don't live in chicago and billionaire black don't live in chicago the spark a gang war that's probably gonna lead to shootings and shit in the neighborhood for dissing each other and both of you guys are far from the community it's kind of crazy even though i do know you are players in the community so that's kind of different i'm not saying they ran away I'm just saying, you know, if y'all ain't really in the hood right now, y'all should leave that shit alone because it's gang shit going on right now. The summertime right around the corner and you know the sun bring the stupid out. So to kind of like entice that shit is kind of crazy. I'm not sure if this going to lead out to an all out war where people are really trying to hurt each other. But, you know, right now is a touchy time. A lot of people heart is heavy right now. So I don't really think this is the time for uh, people to be dissing each other who got past histories of shootings and shit. It could lead to something deadly, in my opinion. It's the homie truth. But it.